I'm out here trying to catch up with my old mate Bo Miles. They reckon he runs around here a fair bit. But he's hard to find. And then he's even harder to catch. Here he goes. Well, actually, Bo and I have known each other for a long time. Hey, my name's Brian Ponchwacho. My name's Bo. Miles. <laughs> He's getting better at remembering his name. This is me, Bo. Which is good, because he's on YouTube all the time. Building stuff. Chopping things. He writes a bit. I don't mind, actually. The, the book is a bit funky. Sleeps in weird places. And is famous for eating just about anything. But even though he has a PhD, which I supervise, by the way, he still can't use the apostrophe of possession. We've spent lots of time together, in the outdoors, teaching, paddling, filming paddling, and drinking tea, lots of tea. But he's a hard man to catch. So we set a date for breakfast, with a difference. Now, he's the elite ultra marathoner, so he'll be running, and I'm your average 62 year old cyclist. But I might have a few tricks up my sleeve, just to see if I can slow old Bo down, otherwise he'll be smoking off in the distance. Have you ever been for a run with a bloody raw egg before? Well, that's what Pontius said. He set the challenge of Rotto. He's going to ride. I'm going to run. We're taking an egg each, porcelain cups each. Yeah, the wily old bastard. Look at that. He's <laughs> he's got some a bit of a bit of tree brush, a bit of she oak. There's a little piece of me that hope it fails. <laughs> okay, we're away. So Pontius claimed to fame. No doubt this is where Bo will mention my 40 year career in education, or the books and articles I've written, or all those outdoor trips I led with him and other students over the years. Is that he's called Ponch because when he was a young bloke heading outdoors one day, you wore a poncho that was bright yellow, didn't you? Well, it was the, it was the first university camp mate. And my brother, who was a Queen Scout, said, if you're going up to the hills, you'll need this and handed me his yellow poncho. Because we got out there, it rained for all of one minute. Surrounded by my uni mate, new uni mates, and I thought, shit, I better put my poncho on. <laughs> Ponch stuck. <laughs> okay, I've bought Ponch on a track that should break his egg. <laughs> now, <laughs> I don't mean to be mean-spirited, but you know, I think you should go as fast as you can. I hear the sounds of a sloshing egg in I there. Hear the sounds of an egg against China. Oh. He's a wily old bugger. See, you know, he's going, he's on the brakes going downhill. You hear the slowest descent of all time. <laughs> all right, left, mate. Let's go see the bridge. All right, cup of tea spot coming up. Oh, yeah, I reckon. Yep. I would imagine what you're doing, Ponch, is illegal. On a vehicle, <laughs> on your phone. Yeah, yeah, I'm, oh, I'm confident I won't be pulled over here this morning, mate. <laughs> yes. Officer, I'm making a YouTube film. <laughs> I'm not cycling, I'm filming. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Here's the big, wow. lovely bridge up there. What a classic, eh? It's the largest road over rail timber bridge left in Australia and it's just rotting away up there oh. yeah yeah <laughs> yep the cup is okay egg no problemo, Batman. We just needed to create a bit of drama. No cracking. Oh. 
in, in case you haven't picked it up so far, Ponch and I haven't seen each other for yonks. We used to spend five days a week together, working together for a decade. About 15 hours, 15 hours each day in the car commute. Yeah, big commutes. We talked about a lot of things, including golf, poetry, philosophy, uh, bloody anything. I thought I was just in for a, you know, a bit of an egg challenge this morning. We're getting a full-on breakfast out here on the side of the trail. But you should go riding with Ponch more often. Look at that. Ponch, <laughs> good on you, mate. Look at this. That's a breakfast. We might get a little film out of our breakfast on the trail, but really it's just a thinly veiled excuse for two mates to spend some time together. <laughs>